As we all know, uh, this has been a very tough time for many Albertans, including those with addiction and uh, mental health challenges. As a former police officer myself, I've uh, seen how easy it is for vulnerable individuals to get caught in the system without going anywhere. This puts pressure on police services, the justice system, and does not lead to good outcomes for Albertans. Recognizing this, uh, the, police, uh, the Edmonton Police Service, in collaboration with local community organiza organizations, created the HELP teams. The Human Centered Engagement and Liaison Partnership, or HELP, teams were launched uh, earlier this year. The team, which uh, partners uh, with uh, police constables and social navigators, uh, work to identify and meet the needs of vulnerable Albertans. The focus is on helping those most at risk uh, becoming entrenched in the judicial system or harming themselves or others in the community. Uh, today, I'm pleased to announce that Alberta's government is helping everyday Albertans by providing $600,000 to expand the help teams. Police services are an essential extension of the community, and we are thrilled to partner with them in a shared approach to treating mental health and addiction as a health care issue. This is a monumental investment in the city's future. I'm proud of our members, many who you see today, for the hard work and that they have done and continue to do their dedication and passion for changing how we as police do our jobs has proven how valuable social policing really is. What's even more powerful is how they've shown such great impact in less than a year since HELP officially launched. In the first nine months of HELP's presence, we saw a 7% decrease in calls for service compared to the 2020. Through focusing on those persons of which many are struggling with severe addictions problems and of which many are also compounded with mental health struggles and being relentless with our partners is the follow-up because they matter and this sends that message. We have said since 2019 and EPS, it's time for us to get under our community partners to provide support as well as help them measure impact so success doesn't just be a one-off program that struggles to be funded, but making success something that you're focusing on scaling up. So our role specifically is to connect people to the services that are already in place and to find the exact service they need. So our mandate is like we will help people get ID, birth certificates, we connect them to housing workers, addiction workers, doctors, and then support those people we connect to to help better the lives of our community members. So we'll connect, uh, we'll help with court uh, because a lot of times people don't know when their court dates are, so we'll assist them getting to court, making sure that um, their basic needs are met, and then um, working with the other facilities into have a continuous um, quality of life for our clients.